Good morning, my dear friend. Welcome to Tuesday morning. I hope you're well today. We are looking at Isaiah chapter 59 this Tuesday morning. And in verse 2 it says, But your iniquities have made a separation between you and your God, and your sins have hidden his face from you so that he does not hear. For your hands are defiled with blood, and your fingers with iniquity. Your lips have spoken lies, your tongue mutters wickedness. No one enters suit justly, no one goes to law honestly. They rely on on empty pleas, they speak lies, they conceive mischief, and give birth to iniquity. They hatch adder's eggs, they weave the spider's web. He who eats their eggs dies, and from one that is crushed, a viper is hatched. Their webs will not serve as clothing. Men will not cover themselves with what they make. Their works are works of iniquity. And that's the phrase for today. Their works are the works of iniquity. And we've got to be very careful what our works are. It's true, our thoughts are important, because our thoughts eventually lead towards actions. Our actions are our works, but our works must be purified. Let's go to the Lord in prayer today and just say, Lord, we want our works to be purified. We don't want them to be works of the flesh, but works of the Spirit. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we come to you today. Lord, we ask for your purification. Lord, that we would be cleansed, that the works of iniquity would cease, that works of righteousness would be born from you. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen.